Welcome to my channel, uh, Cola Colometrics. Uh, in today's um, package, I'll be showing you how to convert a wild data to a, 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 a long data. And you can do so for panel data or for whatever data you want to you want to uh, you want to work with. Uh, but in this case, uh, and I'll drop the code at the in the comment section at the end of the, of the, of the illustration. Uh, if you look at these, I have um, this data here. We're uh, talking about immigration, so people going out from uh, cities of origin and labor, they must want to uh, turn around 28, and their destination, destination one, destination two. So you could see uh, from um, destination one is the same as um, city one so zero there is no self immigration um from uh, 170 people immigrated this particular year from uh, city one to city two as you can see here and then it goes on like that but this is like in wide format but i i, I want this to be in a long format so that i may be able to use it for some other analysis that uh, i will want to Okay, so what do you do? The first thing is to, if you've not done that, please install the TIDR uh, package. I've done that, so I don't need to do that again. So this, this is my code, and I'm going to explain what this code does. So I, you can call this anything, but I call it long. Now, this is the function in this uh, package that is responsible for transforming the, uh, the data from wide to long. It's known as pivot longer. Uh, in this case, this is my data frame. So it's land... Uh, 2019, that's my beta frame, and the column I want to keep, so if you look at this, I want to keep this column, this column uh, known as origin, I want it to still be where it is, I, I want to retain it, so that's why I said, okay, I'm going to pivot everything, I'm going to want to change uh, the, 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 the shape of, the, of all the other columns apart from the column with uh, the, the titled origin that's why you have this negative sign there so it specifies the column as you can see except the, the this now uh this the so when, when you change from wide to long so you have to kind of name two other columns uh, as by way of variables so the the uh name i want to give the long variable the name of the long variable, I want to call it destination. So D1, D2, D, they all come out as destination in a long way. And the value of the, that's the migration flow, those values that you see from moving from city one to city two, uh, which are the values, I want to call it, I want to call them migration flow. So these are things that you must have, in, that all, all are within the same packet, they are within the pivot longer function. And if I run this, uh, and now this is it. So you can see now, I have this, my data in long format, you see, just straight from city one to city one, no migration, uh, but from city one to city two, yeah, you've got, so uh, I've got this um, in this format. So, and you can see it's already in the long format and you could use it for whatever analysis you want to use it for. So this is the one way of doing this. Uh, in the next video, I'll show you another way of another way of kind of changing long formats wide formats to long format data sets uh, on how thank you please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel so that you can get updates as they come around see you bye